Well, hello, all my fluid art friends. It's Doris at DF Designs. Tonight, I'm going to try four different whites in the resin to see which one does the best for the, uh, whoops, sorry about my arm. I just, my, my computer, my, my screen just caught up and I saw my arm in there and I apologize for that, but I'm limited on space. Okay. First, I'm going to mix up the the, uh, the sand. So I got uh, 12 ounces of re resin. I think that's going to be enough for all this. So I'm mixing up some sand. Don't see anybody here yet. But I'll just keep mixing and I'll watch for people to come in. Oh... I should have not put so much sand in this cup. This is not the easy part, but this is not the um, fun part either. Hmm. Anybody in the chat? Okay. Anyway, I just poured some resin in there, and I'm trying to make the sand into a paste. And that means I've got to get all the way down to the sand at the bottom. Huh. I wonder where my chat is at. Let me see what's going on with my chat. Ah, oh, there it is. I lost all of my ch my chat never showed up. I'm so sorry. So let me get over here. Hello, Michelle. Hello, Patricia. Hello, Kim. Hello, Cheryl. Hello, Julie. And if anybody's up there that I missed, hello. <laughs> okay, I thought I was talking to a dead room. My chat was not showing at all. And you know, I need people to talk to. And hello, Jeff. Hail, Jeff B. I didn't know you were in Maryland. I used to live in Baltimore. Before that, I lived in um, um, Brooklyn Park. Before that, I lived in Laurel. Before that, I lived in um, River, Riverdale. Or River, Riverdale, I think, over by D.C. And then before that, I lived in Crofton. So I've lived all over Maryland. Huh? Little fun fact for everybody that you probably didn't know. Well, some of you probably know that I'm a, um, that I'm a, um, Baltimore girl. I'm looking to see if I missed anybody. Oh, okay. And I don't know why my chat didn't refresh. Okay. I don't have, see, this is hard to, okay, I'm going to put some of it out and then add a little bit more resin to get to the stuff at the bottom. Okay, I knew I was going to need two sticks for this. Oh, you grew up in Crofton? That was the very first place I lived at. I lived over in the G section. And Jeff, no, if, if Jeff remembers right, the Crofton was divided up. The, all the streets that started with G were in one spot, and I can't remember the other letters. And hello, Deb. Okay. I'm trying to stand up to get a little bit more of this in here. Because I don't want any sticking up like I had happened before. Because I'm going to have to sand that sand off there with a Dremel. Beaches don't have to be perfect. Okay, now maybe I can get to the sand down there. Ah, there we go. Okay. And hello, Melissa. And hello, Tish. Nice to see you guys here. Um, if one of the mods could hit a hide on that, please. Pretty please. 
Um, Michelle, we don't advertise our cha other channels here, hon. Oh. I'm sorry, Michelle. And poor Frank. Poor Frank, huh? Thank you, Cheryl. Yeah. I thought you would have had a bigger and better Frank built by now. I mean, you have all those computer parts, but I know you've been doing other stuff. Okay, the sand is just your basic everyday sand that I got from, um, oh, that's no problem, Michelle. I mean, if I knew who you were, you know, um, I would, um, I would say I would have one of my mods put your link up, but we're kind of a, you know, we're an artist community, but we're kind of like a close-knit artist community um, as far as uh, YouTube channels go. Have you a... Oh! <laughs> Is this dinner? Hi, Trey. No, it's not dinner. No, it's not dinner. And it's not cat poop either like uh, Ma Lu thought one night. Star Trek Day... Today, I didn't know today was Star Trek Day. Okay, thank you. Okay, now this, I'm not sure. These are those coasters that have the high sides. And I think I got to put a little bit of the uh, sand down into the coaster itself, into the edge. Ah. Uh. Okay, need a little bit more right there. See, this part is the hard, is the slow hard part. Okay, and I apologize for that. But I'm also trying to make sure I pat it down, so I don't have any sand sticking up that I'm going to have to dremel off. <laughs> Thought it was cat food. Um, Malu has some um um. Um, things to say about it. She said, it, well, it kind of looks like cat litter in a way. If any of you have cats and you clean out your cat box, that's what this looks like. Okay. Anyway. Oh, Tish, are you going live later? Um, I didn't know if you were going live later or not. And while I'm still trying to get rid of the last of the sand in here, I do want to say welcome to all you new people. We are a very friendly bunch here. Ask any questions that you want. And hello, Elisa and Zoe and Tater. Those are her two uh, fur babies. I always say hi to her fur babies. Every time I send her a package, it's got to be Tater approved before. He's got to give it the sniff test before. She opens it. And hello, Jan. I ended up with too much sand made. I don't know if I... Uh... So I may just end up... I don't have anything else to put it in. So I may end up just leaving it in the cup, unfortunately. And Jan, yours is almost dry. Yours is almost dry. Jan, Jan was lucky enough. Oh, shoot. Hang on a second. I got sweat running in my eyes. Where's my towel? Oh, this will be good enough to wipe my eyes. Um, nothing like having sweat behind your glasses. And you got resin all over your gloves. And you can't find something to, to wipe your eyes with. Okay. Uh, Jan was lucky enough to be our winner. Um... <laughs> Stop staring at your mama's popcorn. 
Um, um, on Sundays, I do acrylic pouring. I'm better at resin than I am acrylic, so I do my my stuff on on what I call test canvases. Uh, inexpensive um, eight by eight by um, tens. So I always give one away on Sunday. So if you haven't stopped by on Sunday, Sunday at 12 noon, I am live. Let me see what that looks like. That will push you down. Okay, I'm not going to fool with this anymore. I will throw the rest of that sand away because I do not feel like taking forever with it. And i got to wipe off my stick real quick. Now, before I pour resin into the pieces, I'm going to pour some in these four little cups. If you didn't notice down in the description, I listed Echo Art Solutions. Um, I listed their cups, their, their mixing set, because these little one-ounce cups are just great for... Um, for little, for little projects, and I don't need a whole lot of white, so I'm testing out four different whites. I don't know if you could tell by the uh, by the uh, thumbnail. I have got um, the casting craft, like we always use in these uh, 3D uh, white parts, but I also have um, just resin, which is a paste. It's titanium white, and then I also have. Blanco Blanco, uh, Blanco Blanco um, alcohol ink and uh, Amsterdam um, acrylic uh, white ink. And we're gonna see, not tonight, but well, we're gonna see how it goes into the into the thing. Okay. I don't want to fill these up all the way because I'm going to put another two layers probably over this. Uh, I'm trying to keep my sand down in the <laughs> down in the beach, but it won't stay. Okay, I think 12 ounces was just enough for this. Fortunately, you gotta let um. Oh, that's what's wrong. Oh, Michael, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I didn't know that. We'll say a prayer for him. In case you all don't know, Michael Sean Carter is the, the, the sexy voice that you hear on Tisha's Lives. He's got that chocolatey type of uh, voice. That all the women swoon over. I mean, Tish, he's, he might be your man, but the rest of us can swoon over his voice. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> you know, I might be turning 60 this year, but I'm not dead buried and pushing up daisies yet. Okay? So I can enjoy... Hello, Angela! Nice to see you, honey. And thank you, thank you, thank you for your support. I've got a couple of um couple of videos coming up that I'm going to put as members only. So you'll get to partake in that. And you get the cute little badge behind your name. Oh, you're laughing at that? Well, I'm sorry, Michael, you know. Okay, first I'm going to do, first I'm going to pop some bubbles. I see bubbles, tiny bubbles. I don't want to get a YouTube copyright infraction. So that's all I'm going to sing is tiny bubbles. Okay, I think that got rid of it. Michael has a sexy voice and a heart of gold. Yes, he does. Yes, he does. And he can be hilarious, sober or drunk. <laughs> <laughs> you 
We love you, Michael. You know that. Didn't Tish tell you when you started dating that we were all crazy and you had to pass her friend's approval? <laughs> okay, I'm trying to put just one drop. There we go. Just up. Oh, let me scrape, scrape off what's on top of the stick. To put that in there. Um, Oh, that was Tish that said that. I saw the heart of gold, but I didn't know who said it. Okay. Here is the casting craft. You know what? I'm going to put the casting craft over here because that's going to be the casting craft one. But I'm not going to put it in there yet. I'm going to mix the other three. I'm trying to see. <laughs> I kind of figured she did. You should have known that um, Saturday I came to see y'all in Janesville. I'm just like all of our other friends, okay? So you gotta you gotta put up with us. Okay, I am using the the teeniest tiniest amount of this just resin paste in there because I don't know, and that's going to be this one. Now I'm going to put a little bit. <laughs> I'm the crazy old woman, okay? You might be the crazy queen around these parts, but um, I'm the crazy old one. Okay, this is Blanco Blanco. It's in a bottle because I I can't figure out how to how to get it out of one drop out of this bottle. So you put it in what you got. Okay, I'm only going to put two. Well, that looks like two drops. I'm not sure. Okay. Now, yeah, I hate these little caps, though. These things are not easy to get back on right. Okay, this one over here will be the alcohol. And then this one will be the Amsterdam Acrylic Ink Titanium White. Hey! Hello, Chris. Julie, Julie, I've got to tell you this, okay? I thought that I was supposed to keep that uh, pouring recipe, pouring medium recipe quiet. No, it was just the one paint that he uses that I was supposed to keep quiet. So if you go below any of uh, Chris's videos, you'll see the pouring medium I used in that wild one I posted in the uh in our, our group chat the other day the one that was way 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 out of my comfort zone okay this is this is the titanium white now there's only three drops in there and i hope three drops wasn't enough so okay that one's going to be this one let me mix up the titanium white i think it's going to be a little bit thicker the color it's not going to be as as transparent as the other ones yeah it looks pretty transparent but we're going to see doesn't matter if it's transparent or not will it sink and will it make waves that's the big 20 64 question this is the alcohol ink the alcohol ink and the um Acrylic ink look like they are very, very transparent. Okay, this is the alcohol ink in there. It was just a couple of drops. Okay, so um, I want to do, I'm going to do these back here first. I'm going to make sure they're still on camera. Okay. I put my alcohol ink over here so I know which one is which. And this one is the acrylic ink. Okay. Now, I did realize something, even though I had a viewer tell me they look like jellyfish. I'm trying to keep the, bl the big blob off the end of my stick. So, oh my God, you can hardly see it.
Oh my God. Um, I don't know if it's show. I don't know. Th no, I think it's, uh, Oh, only a $64 question. Yeah, I am pretty cheap, huh? Okay, I do not know. I'm not going to add any other white to this. I'm going to leave it the way it is. Okay. I may have to just pour it in. Can, any, can you guys see that? I mean, I'm having a hard time seeing it, and I'm right in front of it. Okay, let me blow this out a little bit. I already had my heat gun on, so I've blown all my little dust burgers out. If anybody knows me, I always say blow your dust boogers out away from your piece before you, um, before you do anything on your resin. Can you guys see that white? Oh, okay. Thank you, Cheryl. There you go. It's a silicone mold. I don't want to leave it on there for too long. So, let's see now how the acrylic ink shows up. And I'm going to forego the stick. I don't need a stick, right? So, I'm going to do a big line right here. And then I'm going to do some little lines across. I can see that better. A swimmer. <laughs> I know what you're referring to, Tish. Ha ha. Uh, no, this isn't a fast setting resin. This is the uh, Stone Coat's craft coat. It sets in about, it, it starts to get globby in about um, 30 to 45 minutes. And I did mix it right before I went on camera so I could start mixing the um, sand before I, before I started it. So... I got it on um, low air and low heat, okay? So, well, I'm going to leave those the way they are, okay? This is just an experiment. This is the Just Resin Titanium White Paste. And I'm going to do my big line right here. And then I'm going to do some little lines up here. Oh, going to do the time warp. Okay. I don't know what was said to make her go do the time warp, but you have fun, Julie. So this is what I like about putting the white and just the clear. It does not get lost and blend into the blues. I want it to feather out some. I 
I don't want to have to drag my stick through this. There we go. Now it's starting to feather out. Come on, go guy, go, go. I got a very temperamental wave here. It just doesn't want to go out into the, into the ocean. There we go. There we go. Okay, now, I'll bring the tray up to get it closer. But now, let's use the old standard casting craft that everybody uses in their 3D flowers, but I don't like doing flowers, so I'm doing waves. And now, oops, that gun is hot. Get my face close to the gun. Now I'm going to do a big one here. I am actually getting some lacing over here. I love that. Okay, um, let me put that right there. I will come in with a baby wipe and clean where I dribbled over the edges, but I did that so I didn't get the big globs in the, um, in there that look well somebody t one of my viewers told me they look like jellyfish huh that way that way wave you go that way come on come on little guy the water's fine jump in This one did some really good effects. I love that. These, these are lacking, but I'm not adding any other white into them, okay? It's an experiment and I'm not gonna cheat. This one, I, I, I'm in love with this. I think I'm going to start using my just resin paste on all of these I see. Oh, bye, Michael. Yeah, go walk, Scout. Thank you for letting here stay. Okay, let me see how I can do this. Okay, um, I'm just going to leave. No, I, I am so tempted to put some some of the JR resin in there, or the JR t uh, titanium white in there, but I'm not going to. For experiment's sake, I'm going to let it sit overnight. So, let me bring this little guy up. This one's still moving a little bit. Well, they're all moving. But that is the casting craft, which everybody uses. This is the Just Resin. This is the Amsterdam ink. And this one is the alcohol, the Blanco Blanco. So, what I'm going to do with this is, is, um, Carrie, oh, hi Carrie. I didn't see you come in. So what I'm going to do with this is, I'm going to let it set. I This one's going to get blue and green. This one's going to get blue and green, even though it doesn't look good. 
and um, I'm going to pour the other layer, and I might, like I did on the other ones, I might do, uh, the next day I might do to fill it in, I might do, uh, oh, I have, wait a minute, is that Carrie as in um, Carrie in Texas, or, or is that the other Carrie? There's no picture, I can't tell. Sorry. Um, so that's what I'm going to do with them. And then I'm thinking, Cheryl's going to hate me for this because she won't be there. Um, but I'm thinking of um, unmolding them at the start of my, um, at the start of my um, um, live Sunday. So don't forget Sunday at... 12 noon central standard time i go live i do acrylics and i give away one of the paintings they're just little small um they're just little small oh yeah oh carrie and oh okay okay now i know which carrie you are i just hadn't seen you for so long I'm just basically cleaning up what I can around the edges so it doesn't stick there. So, join me Sunday when I unmold these. Oh, that's right. Okay. Um, thank you guys for coming out. I adore each and every one of you. I, I love the resin right out of you. You know my saying. I love the resin right out of you guys. Um, if you're watching the replay, there'll be a link up in the corner to the um, to the other um, to the other um, videos I did like this. And here I am. Nick Nimmin tells me not to say um or uh, and I'm doing it. Ugh. Um, and, um, there'll be links down below, too, um, about, um, the other, there, I did it again. Uh, <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to get out of here before I put my foot in my mouth with all these ums. So, thanks for coming out, guys. I love you. Take care, and see you all next Sunday, and don't forget, are you going live tonight, Tish? I didn't see a link anywhere. Oh, please answer questions. Okay, what were the questions? May I know which white paint is used? Okay, this is the casting craft. Just a little drop in there. Okay. This one was the alcohol ink, Blanco Blanco. This one was the um, Just Resin Titanium White, which you can't read the label. And this one was the acrylic ink, the white acrylic ink. Oh, thank you very much, Michelle. Um, Okay, okay. Um, I just I just never saw a link, or maybe she's already gone. So uh, we're all going to go over to the Artist Haven and watch her. Uh, well, I got cups to clean first because I don't let the resin sit in these because it's so hard to clean out these little cups. So I will see everybody over there. Y'all have, did I answer all the questions? I didn't see um, if I did or not. Did, did I answer all the questions? Okay. Um, Cheryl, if you have a link for hers, you can put it in the chat. Yes, I saw, uh, I saw that, Angela. I saw, thank you very much for your support, Angela. Yes, I saw that she... Um, Okay, you go get Tisha's link while I'm um, um, saying goodnight to everybody. Bye, Carrie. Now I remember which one you are. Thanks for coming out. And, um, yes, I saw that Angela. Um, thank you, Cheryl. Bye, Elisa. Bye, Tater. Bye, Zoe. So I'm going to let the whole group of you go. I love the resin right out of you guys. And all I can say is see you at the Artist Haven. Bye for now.